Only seven races set down for decision at Club Manega on Tuesday afternoon. I thought there were three worthy investments on the card. Commencing in race four with the Ross Adams train, Louis. I did tip Louis a special here last week. He went down by a narrow margin behind Island's Joy, for dictating the terms. I think David Morris can once again dictate with Louis from a better draw. He comes in a few slots. I think he should be the one to beat this time around Louis in what does look like a suitable assignment for this very consistent customer. I'm moving over to race five. I'm sticking with Clara Shogun here, trained by Kerry and Morris. Robert to take the drive. And as we've heard from Robert on a couple of occasions, he's got a big opinion of this likely race three-year-old. Just the three starts. He opened his career as runner-up on two occasions at Newcastle and then back to his home track. Very impressive in winning last time out. He's still a work in progress, Clara Shogun. And once he puts it all together, he's certainly got a very bright future. Moving over to race seven, a newcomer to the Jack Trainer stable from New Zealand, a four-year-old mare by the name of Brave You Kelly. Now, she's had 35 starts with seven wins and eight placings. She hasn't raced since finishing last at Addington on the 24th of June. She hasn't trialled for Jack, but no doubt in this particular grey with a good draw, she hasn't come over here just for a holiday. I think Brave You Kelly is certainly worth the gamble in the final event under the care now of Jack Trader, who will also take the reins. And then my thoughts for the Common Angle meeting on Tuesday afternoon, the three specials. Until next time around, good punning.